Hello, it's Black Burning Ice with a uh, new tutorial on how to make custom Tap Tap 2 and 3 um, songs. This method will require Tap Studio on your iPod. Um, basically, Tap Studio is a tap clone in which you can make your own uh, taps. So, in this video, I'm going to show you how to convert them into Tap Tap 3. So, the reason I'm on my computer right now is because you need Tap Studio, an older version. Um, which is cracked. Uh, this is not illegal. Tap Studio was free for um, to start off with. All the versions were free, so no, normally only cracked it so you can get the old version, uh, which is the only one that will convert so far. So open up Total Commander or SSH. Go into your iPod. Go to Private, Bar, Mobile. Um, that's where I cracked it. Um, library, downloads, drag the file into there. Go into install this. I'm not going to record this part, just go into install this. Um, if you don't know what that is, it's a Cydia app. I can tell you how to get it if you don't know how. Uh, get install this. Um, go into your download section for install this. Um, install that. Um, and then you'll have Tap Studio. If you have the newer version, get rid of the newer version first and then down, um, install this one. So now I'm going to switch to my iPod uh, to show you how Tap Studio works and some things you should be aware about. Okay, um, now I'm at, I am at my iPod. Um, you should have installed Tap Studio by now, so go to where you install Tap Studio. This wasn't the intentional purpose of Tap Studio, but people have cracked it to do this. Well, not cracked it, but I have created a converter for it. Hit go. Uh, that's the song I'm recording. Six, by all that remains. That's a little blurry, the autofocus and cache it. Um, hit record. Please current taps. I cannot record with one hand. Um, long notes. Uh, we are trying to find a newer version of this. Um, so that the um, long notes will sync better. And double notes, I mean. Uh, double notes do work. Just every time I record, they just decide not to work. Like, I'm not even kidding. This thing just hates me. So... Whenever you're done, the song should automatically stop. You don't have to hit the stop button. And then, um, be aware of this. You have to hit the home button and exit. Well, at least I do. Or else the song will not work that you just recorded. It'll just pop up a few notes and then stop and freeze. So then hit go. Or you can hit recent for other songs. Play. As you can see, the double notes went that well together, so I'm going to see if I can get 1.2, I believe it was. Like I said, the new version will not work. I just need to find a friend who has the newer version, but not the newest. So, done. Um, that's it for this portion. Now I'm going to go back to my computer and screen record and Okay, I'm back at my computer now. Um, so now it's time to get the song and convert it. Hold on a second, I left my iPod somewhere. Oh, never mind, found it. So plug in your iPod to your computer. Make sure it's detected. Open up Total Commander SSH. As you all know, my personal preference is Total Commander. Um, go into your Applications folder. Find your Tap Studio folder. I believe mine was BD. Yes, there we go. Um, here, go into your Documents. Do not go into the Tap Studio app. Go into Documents. And here's the song I just recorded. 
so drag that um, wherever now I have it set to open with notepad it's not supposed to be opening with notepad um, you're gonna have to get iPod robot plus editor and drag it in copy and paste well copy um, you can try the website you can try this website but a lot of my friends have been having problems um, getting it to work um, you have to use a certain browser and stuff um, usually it's Internet Explorer 8 that, that's the only one that usually works Google Chrome worked for me um, Firefox did not work so just in case I'll have um, the web page that is saved um, uploaded uh, open that, that up with Internet Explorer 8 I heard reports that 7 doesn't work make sure you have the data copied um... song name done and here's your tap studio file i mean ttr2 file now all i need to do is copy that um... new folder as the track uh... new text document paste that in here, file, save tab track dot ttr2 underscore track yes okay when you're done um, put your info p list in here your artwork and your audio and then like usual go into total commander ssh go to um, your tap tap file go into your tracks and then just drag your track file into here um, open up tap tap and your song will work if it doesn't um, e um, send me a message or comment um, I usually f fix these problems or there's one type of problem I can't fix and um, I don't think you can get this kind of problem with this so if you have any questions ask me I'll solve them um, hope you can make your own cust customs now this is how we make our customs now until create to tap comes out we didn't make the beta um, well we didn't make it into the beta so we use this instead so hope that helps make your own customs um, ask questions join our website be active at our website